Well, you already know what this is. I had a few changes. And I, I, like, like I said, I think I remember telling you I was going to change the tyres. I thought I'd try these ones out. They're on the same rims. They're 1.9s and I think they're about 90. Not maybe 85, 90 millimetres. And the other change is... Uh, oh, it's both come off, look. It was the system, I have to sort it out. But as you can see, I'm using this system. But, um, uh, well, just proves that that didn't work. But I'm going to run it either way. Oh, I only pl plug the battery in. One minute. Let's sort this out. I'll put this on my head. I'll plug the battery in. And then sort it out. That's it. Hopefully that will hold it. But... Yeah, that's that's ready to go. Let's put this back on. I'm gonna have to use a different glue, but hopefully them two that they, they would hold it. That obviously happened when it was in my bag, but it doesn't matter. Like I said, <coughs> <coughs> now here we go. So I've got a few other tyres in which I've got and getting and rims, you know, alloy rims and that in which I want to try it as well. So there'll be a few changes to the tyres and rims. That's a full pelt. Anyway, let's hope we can get around here. This looks pretty caked up. All this rain has helped this to grow. Gonna get through there. No, nope. it's not getting through there. Gonna have to go a different way. No matter what, it's not getting through there. First time that's happened. I see there's another way here. Yeah, these tyres, I just thought I'd try them out. They don't look too bad, but I don't think they're going to be as good as the the others that I'm getting and I've already got. Because they're quite thin and they're quite small. But they don't seem to be doing too bad on this wet grass. Remember, this is wet conditions. They're not slipping, so don't seem to be doing that bad. Uh, 
there, see. This grass will defeat this. Too much grass now. Looks like I've only got paths to go on today. All this warm weather has brought all this grass up quick time. And plenty of rain over the last few months. Oh, my feet are soaked already. Looks like he's that crow again. Way too deep again. They're not, they're not doing too bad, these tyres. I think they look a bit small for this truck. I think that's the style of the cab. It's just looks a bit small. Cause the cab's really big. The ones I was using before, those about, I think they're about 90 mil, something like on 95. So, um, uh, you know, the the height of the car, the um, uh, the side itself. Well, these ones, you don't, you don't seem to do too bad. You know, I might use them again. I'm just trying them out, and obviously, you know, I came out to try the the magnet system out. Obviously, um, uh, the rear failed. The front held on all right, but the rear failed, and it's hold, still holding well. And uh, they're, they're bigger magnets there. They're, they're t um, 20 by 10 by three. So um, uh, they're, they're, they're you know neo -dedium or something. I can't remember. But yeah, I got them f from Amazon. You know, I, I couldn't tell you which um, uh, distributor, but you know, they're, they're around about 10 to 15 quid, I think about 8 to 15 pounds, depending on who you buy them from. And that's for 40. I've used 8 on here. You know, it's then. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to be trying more bead locks and, you know, for weight. And, um, uh, you know, give it a bit more weight. 
so I've got, I've got some metal bead locks, like I said, coming through. And I've, I've got some at home, but... Like I said, I've got a few coming. So, I'll wait until I get, you know, a few sets, and I'll try them out, you know, one by one. Oh! <clears throat> it's my own fault. Let's put that down there and get this over. So you get them just the two, <laughs> the two fronts, or the four fronts that's holding that body on, and it's doing alright. So with the back, that probably would never have come off if I had the back ones on there properly. And then magnets are mega powerful. I tell you, they're really powerful. It's like when I first glued these, I picked that, I picked it up by the cab, and it's still stuck together. They're still stuck together. So it's well worth investing if you want to get magnets. Get these, these ones, or bigger. Because it's like the, the little 10 mil round, um, circular ones. You know, if you use a few of them together, like four to six of them, so they spread them out, and put them on something very similar.